today we are going to see about commutation and the inner poles of the machine in larger machine the commutation process would involve the too much sparking which causes burst wear noxious gases that promote the corrosion in this case it is common to use separate commutation inner poles these separate usually narrow or seemly digital pole pieces which carry armature current they are arranged in such a way that the flux from the inner pole drives current in the commutating coil in proper direction so this is a diagram for the dc machine here we have one field pole then the field pole the field pole is fixed in the yoke or field pole fixed in the yoke of the machine the field pole carries a coil called field winding and uh, field winding and uh, this is the central part of the machine is called rotor rotor carries a winding is called armature winding or armature coil in between the from the diagram in between the stator poles we have one more pole is inserted in the machine that is called commutation or inner pole commutation or inner pole here remember that the coil being commutated is located physically between the active poles and the inner poles is there therefore in right spot in influence commutation the inner pole is wound with armature current it is easy to see that the inner pole must have flux density is proportional to the current to be commutated since the speed which with which the coil must be commutated is proportional to the rotational velocity and is voltage induced by the inner pole if the right number of turns are put around the inner pole the commutation can be made be quite accurate thank you